Thank God, somebody I like. Whoa, Whoa somebody woman. Somebody I can tolerate. <laughs> okay, rude. Second of all, girl, you're at school. <laughs> like you're at your place of work, woman. Anyway, hiya, peeps. Welcome back to Honey Pop. Iko is here to greet us with a beautiful swimsuit that she should not be wearing at her place of employment. But hey, who am I to judge? Right? Right. Um, we're just gonna... This is very distracting for me, personally. I don't know what you guys are doing, but... Girl, I need you to dress up a little bit. Okay. Um, it's gonna take me a second to get back to what we were doing. I guess first things first, we're just going to, uh... Check out our mail. Our phone. Oh, you should come in for my yoga class someday. Don't worry, you won't be doing this. I take it easy on the beginners. Hee <laughs> hee. Cute little smiley face. Okay. Whoa. Girl. How are your boobs staying in that top? That's my question. That's my, like, sincere question. But girl, you go. Like, that's some good yoga-ing. <laughs> sure. Okay. Um, let's check out Aiko's profile, even though I was supposed to be looking at it when I was in here. Last name and age, that's all we know about her. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, buy some gifts, maybe? A puzzle cube, wow. Cause she's smart, you know, she's went to college. Some rice balls, cause she's Japanese. Unique gift for a Japanese woman. Ridiculous. Um, how about an eggplant? <laughs> wink, wink. Here, have some rice balls. Where did you get your hands on this? Um, easily, but hey, also have an eggplant. This is great. <gasps> I know. On campus are so gross. How? It's the only campus in town, supposedly. Have a Rubik's cube. Stupid jerk. Wow. I love it. I'm glad. <gasps> hey, we got a present. Girl. Uh, yeah, that. Ooh. What could it be? Consume all joy tokens on the grid, earning plus one move for every token consumed after the first two. Um, I'm willing to try it out. Why not? And you know what? We're going to take the perfume and try that out on the inevitable date that we're going to have with Aiko in a second. Um, which I guess we could go on that date now and then we'll talk to her when we come back. Okay, let's go. Yeah, all right. Why not? Well, don't be so excited for it. <laughs> <sighs> Look at this! We've got the whole ring to ourselves! Oh, back to no no glasses. Ice skating in glasses seems a little dangerous. Okay, so you like sexuality, I do know that, and you would dislike blue. That's cool, that's cool. Man. I feel like I'm sitting really close to my computer. But hey, it's whatever. Um So right off the bat, don't see any moves. That's unfortunate, but hey, it's life. Um, uh, yeah, let's just start with some passion and we'll eventually move into other things, I'm sure. Hopefully. <laughs> oh, nice, nice. Um, so how have you guys been? I've been good. I got to only work six hours instead of eight hours today because... I work in a factory, and sometimes we ain't got work to do. And everybody was a real big fan of that, being able to leave early. Because, you know, it's Friday, I wanted to get my weekend started. I wanted to sit down and play a little bit of honey pop with y'all. I have enough sentiment to do anything I wanted to right now. And we're going to give her the perfume first thing. Ooh, maybe I should give her the broken hearts, I don't know. Um, we'll go with this. Noise. And also take this. Okay. We're gonna get that passion level all the way up. Just for you, Aiko. Uh, 
So luckily while I was editing, I didn't see a whole lot of like matches that I didn't do. I wasn't too angry at myself, but a lot of it's just because I'm being so slow with these dates and I'm somewhat sorry for that, but also I care a lot more about making these fictional girls mad. You know, you feel, yeah, yeah. Do dates get money, money, money. Is that a compliment? I hope it is. I'm gonna be really heartbroken if it's not a compliment. Oh, her gold chateau, right? Ch chateau? I'm smart, I just know all my words from reading them and not from saying them out loud. Hee <laughs> hee. Uh, girl, is there any way for me to get more honey from you? I feel really low on honey. So basically the plan is that tonight, whatever girl we go and talk to, we'll get her super drunk and we'll level up a lot. It's the plan. That's our situation there. Okay, she's 28. That's what I know, right? God. She's 28 and her last name is Yumi. All right. Mm-hmm. Uh, what's your favorite color? Nothing to talk about. Wow. <laughs> I just want to know more about you. Uh, I like green. Green's nice, I guess. I ain't got anything against green. So, hey, question. What's the craziest place you haven't done it? I would like to. Hmm. It'd be great to just have any sex at all, don't you know? I'm blue balling from place to place, Aiko. No. Aiko, she's kind of a freak, but like... I don't know, she doesn't she doesn't want you to like pee on her, but she would, however, like some voyeurism, such as underneath her desk. Wink wink. Oh, shit. That would be pretty hot. Whoa, you're into that. Is that a lip bite? I can't tell underneath the The anime lips are already already so goddamn small. Okay. Give me your honest answer. Yes. What was your first time like? Yeah. Girl, of course. Oh, not with my- okay, um... <laughs> uh... You know what? You have a good sense of humor. I don't like to brag, but she came at least three times. Not true. Um, short-lived. I'm not gonna sell myself short like that. Once I found the hole, we were good to go. LOL, nudge nudge. <laughs> well, I hope you remember where it was. Mm, why don't you come with me to the bedroom and we'll find out. <laughs> okay, one more talk. Yes. Um, what did you study in college? Or her job? Hmm, we know what she does, but let's go with what did you study? I got a master's degree in mathematics and I regret it every day. How do you get a master's in mathematics? I was always an English kid. You know, those short stories and stuff. Do I have enough, uh, stuff? The answer is absolutely freaking not. Okay. Well, Aiko, it's been great talking to you. We're gonna go hit up a different girl if I remember. Oh, let's go talk to Momo. Since, you know, I sadly had to cut her off. You feel? Yeah. Yeah, let's go with Momo. Hopefully, I'll see you later. Not today, because we already dated today. I'm so sorry for your loss. Kiska, no. My cat's trying to get up on the table where I'm sitting. I did come to see you, Momo. Hello, I'm here to buy you stuff. Because I didn't get to earlier. I'm so sorry. No! Kiska, no! Thank you! Okay. I'm sorry that I was talking to another cat. You're still my number one. Okay. Hopefully that crisis is averted with my real life cat. Okay. Um... I don't have any special gifts for you, which is unfortunate. Um, 
Girl, have a fruit tart. I don't think I've ever had a tart. Have you guys? Are they good? I don't really like pie, so, uh... Have the bestest fish tank in the whole world. Oh, the bestest fish tank. Let's check out what gift we got. Is it good? Select a token type, and you will not lose any moves until a match is made that is of a different token type than the one you selected. Yeah, not exactly my... my sort of thing. Unless, you know, you guys use it, but... I feel like I never have enough of one token to be able to get away with that. You know? I don't know. Let's go on a date, girl. Wait. Were you, like, expecting me to date you? Is this the thing? What did that man mean when he asked uh, for my ID? Mm, why did I bring her to the casino? It's such a bad fucking idea. Okay. Hi, Momo. I didn't even look to see what you like. You like orange. Orangey. Great. She doesn't like sexuality, which, thank God, because she's a kitty. <laughs> um, so, the special girls. Because, um, spoiler alert, there's, there's several. Um, their dates are usually harder. Like, if you're going to fail a date, it's usually one of the special girls. And there's always exceptions to the rules. The rule of... That's how the saying goes, right? <laughs> um... Yeah. I'll definitely be getting the other special girls, but you know, um... First you gotta get through a couple others. <gasps> yes! Amazing! Right, right, right. Uh... More passion? So, yeah. I got out of work early, I went and got some Arby's, because this week has been a very long one. I don't know if it's just because I know I have a three-day weekend coming up, you know. Factory work equals having Memorial Day off and Labor Day. And you don't get that lucky if you work in anything other than factories. Isn't that some BS? Um, can I drop this down one? No, not three. Well, huh? Diggity damn. Mama, you have so much going on, but I just don't see anything to make it work. Ugh. Well, yeah, yeah, I know, <gasps> Momo, I haven't even given you anything. Here, you're welcome. Okay, Momo's definitely not my type because she does sound very young, very babyish. I like my women more mature, but uh, she's a very sweet little cat girl. And um... I don't know. I don't know. She just sounds so young. I don't know if it's just like... Me being the age that I am? That makes it so off-putting for me? Does anybody else feel this way? Like, not too many of the girls... Put me off like Momo does, but... Um... Sorry, I like the Momo from Twice more. She's a dancer. Yeah, yeah! High five me. You just gotta open your little cat paw. <laughs> wow, you are really, really, really good at this! Good at what? Like, am I actually playing this game in front of you? Is it like on a table and they're like, I swear to god, if you get any broken heart matches, I'm gonna kick your ass. <laughs> Loyal servant. I mean, that outfit was pretty cute. I was a big fan. Okay, let's talk a little. Um, what do you do for work? For work? Yeah. I don't know. I'm a kitty. 
Oh. Dream job, am I right? <laughs> Um, what would you say your hobby is? Uh, I sleep a lot. I'm always really, really sleepy. And yet you're almost never sleeping, according to the honeybee. How, how much do cats sleep in a day? Like 14 hours? 16 hours? Okay. Got a fucking dream what life. Do you want to talk about, hmm? Uh, do you have a last name? Uh-huh. Well, I'm Momo. Okay. Okay, Momo. Momo, Momo. I'm bored. Ask me a question. Wow, this is like the first time that girls have just let me ask them questions like the whole entire time. Uh, so yeah. How much do you weigh? Because you're a kitty. <laughs> I could probably pick you up, girl. Okay, um... <gasps> who are we gonna hit up? I don't know who we're gonna hit up now. Uh... We got Tiffany. Oh, I can upgrade a trait before I go on a date or something. Um, yeah. Tiffany's only got two hearts. Kiana's all... all uh... Audrey. So my personal the personal way that I get through this game is to date my least favorite girls first so I don't have to see them anymore and then and then my favorite girls which is probably part of my problem. And of course Momo's got two. Um. So maybe uh, let's go see Jessie. She's a good one. Oh, wait, her alcohol tolerance is high. We want someone that their alcohol tolerance is like normal. Let's go with Tiffany. I would like Audrey or Tiffany. Mm. Girl, let's go talk to Audrey. She's fun. Okay. Oh, see, and I can't even go see Tiffany. Perfect. Take care, okay? Yeah, you too. Oh, okay. Oh, I got a message from Iko. Excuse me. Audrey, I have important people to look at pictures of. I never text them back either. That kind of sucks of me. Well, fuck me. I finally won something at the casino. Great. Now maybe I can put a tiny debt in my massive debt. You're, you're still de Oh, God. You're still dealing with your student loans? Uh. Okay. That's great, I guess. That's cool. Uh, God, all you ladies saying saying the f word, I don't appreciate it. I would never say the fuck word. Anyway, fuck yes, I finally got the high score on this stupid game. I can't even tell you how many quarters I've lost to this thing. Y'all have a very similar lifestyle. <laughs> Why are you holding the joystick like that? I have questions. Also, the little bunny girl's cute. I also love to play the game game. <laughs> the name of the game. Game. Hmm. Okay, okay. Uh, well, Audrey. Let's go on a little date after I feed you a, a, a thing. Wow, we got two. Fine, it's nighttime. Uh, lighter. Wow. Oh, damn. That is unfortunate. Have that. Preferably. You gave me a new hairstyle. Also, I forgot that Aiko got a new hairstyle and I didn't look at it. Whoops. Um... Okay, we're- oh, sorry. You could totally eat this right now, and apparently you have. Let's just buy you, um... Wait, what do you like? Your favorite's a daiquiri. Okay, I'll get you a little daiquiri. 
just to start you out. Here you go. Yeah, indeed. Uh, let's check out our inventory real fast. We got some presents. <gasps> yes! The penguin is one of my favorites. Uh, plus three sentiment for every four of a kind affection token match. I do actually use that quite a bit. So we're just going to set this off to the side and use the shoes. Because... I like getting sentiment. The better one is definitely whatever one. Uh, yeah, we'll worry about it later. Um, let's buy you some more gifts. Let's get you drunk before we go out on a date. Right? Right. Uh, here we guys. Like, did you guys ever hear that? Not here, but... It's a story that someone posted that they went on a date. And, uh... Like, she was sitting out in her car, just, like, taking shot after shot of, like, vodka or whiskey or whatever. And she basically, like, drank an entire flask worth of shots. And then she went to go get out of her car for her date. And she realized that her date was sitting in the car next to her watching her take all these shots. Like, oof. Uh, okay, let's go on a date. I would never get my hopes up, Audrey. Though you did mention fucking me already, so... <laughs> Too late! Just a second. This is your idea of a date? <sighs> Whatever. Girl, stop acting like you're not impressed. Now I'll go home and change. The green. The girl in red likes the green. We're gonna do the easy matches. Hmm. I'm never smug. <laughs> uh. Damn, Audrey. Uh. See, I don't know what to say during these dates because I'm always trying to concentrate on making sure that I don't goof <laughs> too horribly. That I don't goof too horribly. I'll always be goofing. See, look at that. Could have goofed right there. Hmm. Ugh. You guys ever like have a mysterious smell near you? You can't figure out the source of the smell, but goddamn, is it bad? <gasps> Ooh. Can I use the shoes? Here, have this. Oh. I don't know if I'm into that, but hey, you do your worst. Hmm. I really want some more sentiment, but I can't do that because then these two are going to drop down and I'm going to have a match of four. Heckin'. Broken hearts. So let's just get this done first. That was hot, Audrey. Just admit it. Um. Anything else amazing that I can do? Well, I can do everything amazing, you know, because I'm me. Sorry, you said don't get smug, my bad. This music is so goofy. Like, you, you get it? You get what I mean? Hmm. If I can drop this down one, that would be spectacular. But I don't think I'll be able to. Hmm. Oh? Nice! Look at all that sentiment. It is a big deal. I'll have you know I'm a very big deal. Hmm. Did you guys ever get those stickers from Hot Topic that were like, I'm big in Japan? Because I sure did. Because I was a Hot Topic teenager. 
Well, I wanted to be a Hot Topic teenager, but also when you're like a broke teenager, you can't really be a Hot Topic teenager. You get me? Yeah, yeah. And I'm amazing. And we're done. Girl? Yes. Not bad. I've been on worse dates. I'll admit that much. I mean, I didn't do any broken heart matches, so I think you should be nicer to me. Also, I'm really close to the microphone. I'm sorry. <laughs> well, um, I do believe that that's going to be it for this episode. When we come back... We're going to talk to Audrey a little bit, and she's going to give me all that honey. Honey? <laughs> honey? Yeah, it's honey. So anyway, I'll see you guys next time. Thank you so much for watching. Bye!